Hey everyone, I just want to, uh, first of all, I want to tell you guys, um, the bizarre video yesterday, because, uh, I meant to record a video and I forgot, and then I was going to record this video yesterday, but then I forgot again. Yeah, and it wasn't a video today when, when there was supposed to be because I forgot to, uh, get a video ready to upload today last night. I did nothing yesterday at all, so, yeah. So sorry about that, but that's not the main reason I'm here. Um, I actually want to uh, talk about a bit about what happened in Las Vegas uh, the other day. Uh, I believe it happened uh, Sunday night or Monday morning, one of the two, I don't remember exactly which. Uh, but I not, not, don't want to get into like, a big debate or about anything like that. Uh, if, first of all, if you don't know what actually happened, um, uh, in Las Vegas there was the biggest shooting in U.S. history to ever happen. There was uh, over 50 dead, I think it was actually 59 people that were killed, and I think over, five hu over 500 that were injured. Uh, that is the biggest uh, single, uh, single man attack that's uh, happened in U.S. history ever before. And there are plenty of debates, people trying to figure out who he was, if he was ISIS, if he was uh, Antifa, or if he was just uh, a Democrat that was trying to kill a whole bunch of Republicans, because it was admittedly... Uh, mainly Trump supporters that were killed in the attack, uh, but I'm not here to debate that. I'm not here to talk about who I think did it or talk about gun control or anything like that. I'm here because I really just want to basically just extend a hand out to those who lost someone or, the, or anyone who died uh, in the attack, because I honestly cannot imagine how hard it is right now for anyone who has lost someone. Uh, anyone who uh, had a loved one who was out there just enjoying a concert, you know, I mean, because there are plenty of people that, uh, I don't know exactly what band was performed, but it was at a concert, and people went there, you know, just hoping for a good time, and just wanting to, you know, have fun. There are plenty of people who, who wait years to go to concerts, you know, who are constantly following someone, they just cannot wait for the day to finally arrive, and they can go to a concert, and they finally get there, and at this one, they happen to get shot, injured, and or killed, and it's just... I can't imagine how painful that would be for someone, uh, or even those who didn't necessarily lose someone but were still there and might have gotten traumatized or anything by it. Uh, I cannot imagine what kind of pain anybody that has had an impact from that is going through. And I just want to say that uh, my heart goes out to you and that my prayers are with you and anyone who was injured in the hospital. I hope that all of you can make man manage to pull through and uh, come out come out this just fine as if it never happened, um, even though uh, I'm sure there'll still be mental injuries that will never go away, I do hope that you can at least, you know, you know, be able to move on and be able to recover from it uh, as much as you possibly can. And uh, that's really all I want to say. Again, I'm not again, trying to get into a gun control debate or a political debate or trying to point a finger at someone. That That's not what I'm trying to do here. I really don't want anyone in my comments to do that either. Uh, and if you are uh, subscribed to this channel and you do know someone uh, who uh, died or was at least injured uh, or is even having any kind of adverse effect from the uh, attack, uh, my Twitter is in the description box. You can uh, contact me on there. I mean, you can talk. I'm not necessarily going to be the best help for uh, th any issues you might be having, but I can at least do what I can. Or maybe I can direct you to someone who can help. I mean, there are plenty of professionals who do handle things like that. I'm just not a professional in it. I mean, I've helped people through problems before, but I don't have any kind of training or anything. It's it's more that usually I just know that person well enough where I can help them through whatever problems they're having. So, if you uh, do need someone to talk to, I am definitely here for you. Uh, like I said, you could just contact me on Twitter or, uh, or something. You can, We can talk if you need to. Uh, but I do recommend, however, that you talk to someone who is professionally trained to help you through pro through problems like this, because there are people that are out there who would know how to help you and want to help you. There, you can look them up on Google if you need to. I mean, you can just Google number for uh, there's like suicide hotline. I think there's even it's like people to help you through depression even if you're not just, uh, if you're not completely suicidal. And there's therapists and things like that. I mean, there's plenty of outlets for you to, for you to find help. And I will help you if I can. And if you feel like you need to contact me, but again, I'm just not. Professional help is all. So yeah, once again, my heart goes out to anyone who lost someone or has or is injured or anything like that. I hope that everyone can recover from it, and 
I believe, and I do believe the person who was responsible for it, however, like the person who was actually doing the attack, uh, was, he was either arrested or he was, uh, shot and killed, I don't remember which, but either way, uh, I would say that because of that, justice has been served to him, so, yeah. Uh, I hope that brings any, I hope that brings some sort of, um, comfort to anyone who has lost someone, though I doubt it was, I doubt it's very much, but, yeah. So... Once again, I hope everyone uh, you know can go through it, can go through it just fine. Uh, I hope that uh, everyone can uh, find you know find a way to move on from it and be able to recover from it. And uh, yeah, there's not really a whole else like I can say about that. Uh, please don't start any debates in my comments though about about what you might think what happened or like who's to blame or you know gun control laws or anything like that. Because I'm trying to keep this as a channel. Very uncontroversial. I'm trying to keep this channel very, just very open and just very, just like, <laughs> I don't want to say like a, like, a, a kind of like comfort zone, but not to the point where it's like, you know, no one can say anything offensive at all. Like, uh, like I want people to be, able to be able to speak their minds as long as they're not offending anyone. Just, I don't want people to start arguments and hate in my comments when I just want, you know, a peaceful discussion. If you, if you are just having a calm discussion, as long as you don't argue about something, that's fine. I just, even then, I still don't really want a whole con controversy in my comments. I just want, you know, people to you know, be open and accepting, which I know that that's not, you know, going to be able to be 100% accurate all the time, but it's, this is just what I want to happen. I, this particular channel, I just want my channel to be just to, you know, an area where there is no arguments, everyone just loves each other, and it's just, you know, happy, happy, joy, joy, time for all. I know it will never be, you know, once, you know, this channel becomes big enough, it will never be 100% 100, 100 like that, but that is what I am shooting for. I want it to be just a, just a generally comforting place to be, where you can just have fun, watch videos, talk to some cool people, and that's it. I don't want there to be controversy and hate or anything like that, or arguments. I just want people to be able to come here and have fun and be relaxed. That's what I really want. This is not meant to be a serious channel, it's meant to just be a relaxing channel. That's all it's meant to do. You're just to come here and have fun. So yeah, um, and there will be a, a video tomorrow, probably of Dungeons and Dragons. I don't know when the next Dungeons and Dragons video will be coming out. Probably either Thursday or Friday. I don't know when we coming out uh, the other day. I, I I just don't know what's going on right now uh, with my my videos. I have not really done a whole lot of preparation, even though I meant to. I just was being lazy all weekend, so I didn't do anything. So yeah. And I'm sorry for that. And I'm sorry for everyone who is going through problems uh, because of this shooting. Or really, if you're going through anything and you're having issues, just know that there are people out there that want to help you and are trained to help you. Or even if they're not trained, they still want to try and help. So, yeah. <sighs> and I guess that's it. So, thank you all so much for, wa so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please be sure to drop a comment, leave a like, and subscribe to my channel for more content. Also, please be sure to follow me on Twitter. There's a link in the description box below. And with all that being said, you're now going to have an absolutely fantastic day. You have no choice. Also, all you beautiful people again in the next video. Stay frank, everyone. Ciao.